Father, may there be the manifestation of your greatness in the name of Jesus Christ. Our Father, we dedicate ourselves to your service. We pray for those who will do one thing or the other. Grant gracious Lord, that your supremacy will manifest itself today. That today, Father Almighty, greater glory will be given to you. Today, more testimonies, Father Almighty, will continue to fall like water upon this land in the name of Jesus Christ. And even after we have gone, Father, you will continue what you have begun. Amen. Father, take your place. Amen. Take your seat. Amen. And let all, no other person be seen apart from you. Amen. We pray in Jesus' name. Amen. Praise the Lord. Amen. If our brother evangelist uses your name, please come to the podium. Bishop, are you still ready? Yoruba. Let's go to Yoruba. Give me music. Amen.
everybody are blessed. Lord, we continue to uplift you. Thank you. 
likeness. He gave man everything man needed to be comfortable. God was coming to man every day. The Bible says that in the cool of the day, God will come unto man. He was romancing with man. God had to turn his back onto a man. God was no more coming to visit man. God allowed man alone. God left man alone. And when the devil discovered that God has forsaken man, the devil took over. The devil took over. The devil took over the garden. And man started to suffer. Reconciliation. Uh, of man and the devil. Is an act of changing from the enmity unto friendship. Changing from enmity unto friendship. Because of disobedience. God has seen. Please read for me the book of Colossians chapter 1. Colossians 1, 21 and 22. Colossians 1, 21 and 22. God forsook man because of iniquity. Colossians 1, 21 to 22. His nature, the nature of God is love. 
Michael. He is the epitome of love. No, he is Seb Wayo Michael. The man he created in his own image. He does not want to leave him totally for him. Oh no, it's for you, Paul. God was not happy the way the devil was molesting him. Seb Wayo, when he was in that way, he did. For the propitiation, Lord Almighty, for to to offer him as a peace offering, Lord Almighty, to restore peace between God and Lord Almighty, and Jesus came. Jesus Christ, read on, sister. Oh, 
of your wicked yes. 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 now you have to reconcile for the Lord Jesus for now in the body of his flesh, flesh. in the body of his flesh to present you holy to present you what holy read it again to present you holy to present you holy not that one the one half of the one half hallelujah praise the Lord and blameless now then hallelujah Oh, Zhao. 
Oh Jabi, he suffered. Oh ja, for you to be free. Jesus, oh ja, let that mean. May you be free now in the name of Jesus. Oh, Romans chapter five, verse number ten. Romans. Even as I random. Ever look at that poem, Romans chapter five, verse number ten. For if man will be enemies, will be the enemies of God. Be reconciled. Importance of reconciliation. And he could all of your rakuru. We are reconciled to God through the death of His Son. When we were yet sinners, Christ died for us. When we were yet sinners, Christ reconciled us to Jesus. Much more, having been reconciled, now that we have been reconciled. Because, because of sin, oh, yo, oh. but Christ came to settle us back to the Father. Lord, that moment, we have now that we have been settled with the Father. We shall be saved by His life. Praise the Lord. Somebody say, I am saved. Well, wait for I am saved. I am saved. I am Joseph. 
is the church sleeping? Is the church kidnapped? Where is the church? Church! Master! <laughs> the beginning and the end. The lion of the tribe of universe. <laughs> the master crafter. The holy one. The monarchy of the universe. The omniscient. The greatest. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> 
to be there. Even the church member, the poorest in the church, will be the first person. No wonder your attitude towards fasting and prayer is lukewarmness. Stand straight. No fervency in the church. Because his zeal is paralyzed. You will embark on cosmetic projects at the distance of your zeal. No wonder. I'll be asking, what is church? Your zeal has made you, has disconnected you from me. And they have already called you. Don't you know? My world is meant to be studied and eaten. Because I am the bread of life. Ah, Your zeal. No stamina. Ah, no spiritual motion. Ah, you are a failure. Ah, judge. Uh, Master, call me your vision. Vision. I'm interested in your vision. Vision. Because of your blindness, because of your blindness, and thereby misuse the grace I have given unto you. Your eyes is blinded. You have refused to see that your indebtedness. Look at your grace. You are staying in the eyes, in your hearts, and the part of you like me. Church, look at what you have become. I never have time to check this. Think how you have it. <laughs> because you are blind. <laughs> if your vision is like this, I wonder what evangelism will look like. In fact, I'm interested in evangelism. Sir. Church! Sir! Call me evangelism. I am not disappointed. Immediately I set my eyes on provision. Then I understand how your evangelism will look like. Ah, uh, church! Shut up! You know the implication of your evangelism. Don't 
their life. Do you know the consequences? The evangelism is half dead in the church, and thereby as a result, recruiting failures in the society. The failure of your evangelism is the manifestation you are seen as. You are recruiting murderers. You are recruiting banditries. You are recruiting kidnappers because of your failure in evangelism. Church! Master! The big assignment I gave to you is go and preach the gospel. Go! And pray for the victims. Go! And pray the kidnappers. Are they reducing all their increasing? I misunderstood you, sir. Because you said in the book of Isaiah, I thought I'll fail me. I graduate. Die. But you found me. What are you doing? Pain assessment. Judge! What are you doing? Building houses that will be consumed by smoke. Judge! Master! The purpose in which you have been established has been defeated. This is crocodile tears. Stop deceiving yourself. I want to see love. Come in your love. When love is still alive, ah! but now, love is gone and dead because you are slain and snoring. You have gone into deep sleep. No wonder what you have in the church is fornicators. What you have in the church now. They are white and Congo wines. Pastors sleeping with policies. Church leaders sleeping with church members. And you call it love. Love does not exist. Judge. What is spiritual endowment? You have misused it. You have lost it. Master. You are a failure. Judge. Master. You said you are intact. You said you are okay. You are completely sick. A man. Judge. Before I go, I'm interested in your faith. Faith, call me faith. Faith.
Father, have mercy. You are the God that is merciful to all. Father, you have said in your word that you will have mercy upon who you will have mercy on. You ignored us and you cast us away. But because of your compassion, you gather us back. In the book of Isaiah, 54 verse 7. Father, I plead for mercy. Church, have mercy. I've had you. I will make a change. Church, I will make a change. I've heard you. I will make a change. I have come. I shall save you. I am coming. Like a mighty fire of the ocean. Oh. I am coming. I will go and walk with my sword of anger. I will not come as a savior again. Oh. I will come as a judge. Oh. And I will judge accordingly. <laughs> I will make a change. Go! Oh. And open your eyes. Go! And regain your strength. Your stamina. Your evangelism. And your faith. And build it. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. <laughs> Father, faith will rise again. Carry your faith. <laughs> Chapter 3, verse 17 says, When you are rich, when you are comfortable, and you do not lack anything, and you say, My soul does not search for food again, I am confident. It goes further, says, you are blind and you are naked. Take your nakedness and cover it. I am coming not for goods, not for building, not for cosmetic projects. I am coming for you. Church! The moon, the moon and the sun is an example of me. The moon is now. The moon is very friendly. You can play under it to any length. But the sun, you don't look at it anyhow. Oh, yes. Nobody. I mean, you. You. Except you will concern. Except you will concern. The abundance of a man does not consist about the life he lives. Stop chasing what will kill you. Rather, chase what will save you. Increase your zeal. Increase your passion for evangelism. Rap and walk on your feet. Bring back love. And you will sin in your midst. The Lord be with you all.
the message is very, very clear to everybody. So without wasting time, that message is to our clergy, is to those of us who are lady, lady that evangelist, anybody you are in the church of God, the message has spoken to you. When we go home and reorganize ourselves. So at this time, I want to welcome my brother, evangelist, you see, oh, now they I want to welcome you to the microphone. We have spoken enough to the people of Afuze. This is a time of decision taking. Come and lead us into this session of decision taking. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Praise God. Let us pray. Thou art walking. We plead with you now. We release the power of the Most High God over this 
community in the name of Jesus. Amen. And we take authority over every struggle. Mm. In the name of Jesus. Amen. We defy every power that was mm. stand against the will of the Father. The creator of all things. Mm. We defy their resistance. Amen. We scatter their stronghold. Amen. We declare their release in the name of Jesus. Amen. Father, those that the devil has blindfolded, mm. that is leading on to hell, tonight, O oh Lord, we release sight unto them in the name of Jesus. Amen. Those that are deaf, O oh Lord, who cannot hear the voice of the Creator, tonight we declare, receive the power to hear in the name of Jesus. Amen. That you bring that man, Amen. that boy, Amen. that guy back to yourself mm. and restore them to yourself. Yes, restore their destiny. Amen. Restore their life. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Oh Lord, our God, to as many that we hear the call, to as many that we hear your voice tonight, they will never be the same. At all. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. So the night of repentance yes, unto the arena. Mm. Anyone hearing our voice now, wherever that person might be, Holy Spirit, bring them here Amen. because they are yours. Yes. Because of them, you send us to be here mm. and we have hearkened to your voice. Bring them. Mm. May they not hear our voice. So. May, they, may they hear your voice. Amen. Call them for you created them to, for your own glory. Yes. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Our God and our Father. Mm. If it be, there be anyone, oh Lord, that the devil has destined for death or for suicide, tonight we restore hope unto that man. Amen. We restore hope to that boy, Amen. to that woman, to that girl. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Father, you told us to go into the world to preach the gospel. That these signs are accompanying those that believe. In your name, we'll lay hands on those who are sick and they will receive their healing. Tonight, anyone that will run to you, that will lay hands upon in your name, O Lord, shall receive healing and you will proclaim your name in the name of Jesus. Anyone that will be tormented by the devil, that will run to you tonight, oh God, as we pray for them, they will be let loose. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. To them, oh Lord, that the hope attached, you restore their hope. Amen. For you told them that the devil came to steal, to kill, and to destroy. But you came, oh Lord, that we might have life and have it in abundance. Lord, call your people to yourself. Amen. That tonight you will glorify yourself. Amen. For in Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Praise God. By the glory of God, the shall have several. And the grace of God, shall see of several. Our Lord Bishop, uh, Bishop Uma, our Sapele Daosis, our Father. Uh, was supposed to do the other call. No, her chap on do a ribbon. But something happened and they could not meet up. Uh, I agreed that I should take the other call. Uh, Maybe that I should take the other call. My president, my God bless you in Jesus' name. Now, without wasting time, you had us since yesterday. And our brother who spoke to us before the play left. Really entered into the message deeply. I expanded it. And he laid it at the head. And you've heard what the people has told you in the planet. We are not going to waste time now. I want to give my life to God. 
Wow, I want to be reconciled to God. As the chorus will go on, you will be coming and we will pray for you. And if I'm the chorus, I am taking my test for the altar call. The Bible says, Come, let us reason together. Whatever position you find yourself, Jesus is calling you tonight. Come, let us reason together. Whatever situation you find yourself, all hope must have been lost. He said, You are the Those who have not been to the church once, when you say your second, whom one thing or the other, the fee is not necessary, or the will or the zeal is not for them, and whom your home went to go to church. This is the first set of persons we are coming to church. But Jesus is saying, Come, let us reason together. Let us look at the matter. The second set of persons.
The Bible says, even though the captain of the mighty shall be delivered, I want to hear the sound in them. Yeah. Well, well, you can hear that. And he said, if you believe that you are winning, who have you who have you? Again, assume the Bible even said, even though the lawful captain and all lucky the moon shall be delivered. Lucky if you're not yes. in your room. In time of ignorance, you've done things that are not right. In time of ignorance, you're not going to use you as a mere tool. And so the way I have this woman, I will you see your hands stained with blood. And then so it's how you have condemned yourself. God is saying, even though the lawful captain. The only shall be what shall be delivered. The only thing if you are willing, he will not more than you come. He has finished it. Now, the prayer of the terrible be delivered. He said the prayer of the terrible. Who are not care of me? He will then have a balawo. He has a way. The God's way for the family. I cannot give you no one. Say this way, God will keep people. Not give you no one. The Father has done so many barbaric things. So you are well. Now, if you do not know, the Bible said tonight, you shall be delivered. Only if you are willing, who have way way, and you can come to let down to give your life to God. When they are born, those complete it, complete it. I will contend with him who contends. He said he will contend with him who contend with you. Who are not bad way way, and you know, by because you believe in him, for your own your home. Yes, God. And he will save you. He will save your children. Those your children are attacked. He Those your children are caught. He not keep They are not willing to go to school. They are not willing to learn a trade. They are not willing to learn a job. They are not willing to learn a job. He said he will deliver your children. As well. How are they not to be as for now? How power belongs to you. Power belongs to you. Power belongs to you. Power belongs to you. Power belongs to you.
declare that you want to go and bring the gospel. Please, my brothers and sisters, you will just go to that corner there. They will write your name. So we have a powerful group in our food. All of us will see ourselves. Go to that corner, they will read Let us pray. They want to speak with one voice. They want to live together as members of the same family. Father, because they have demanded a good thing, tonight, O oh God, I declare that that devil, in whatever form, that have been causing division and segregation in Ogedegbe family in this Afuze. Tonight is the end of that devil in the family in Jesus' name. I declare that devil redundant and cast that devil away from the family. Every power, every means of causing segregation, disagreement among members of the family, I put an end to their work from now on in Jesus' name. Father, let your love transcend upon every member of Ugeregbe family. Not only these ones that are here, but I'm using these ones as a point of contact to reach all of them, every member of this family. 
that has not been agreeing with one another. From tonight, there shall be love. Yeah. And demonstrated by the playlets, the love for one another in this family shall not die anymore. Yeah. I bring that love back to life in the family. Yeah. In the name of Jesus Christ, I set you free from division. I set you free from segregation. I set you free from misunderstanding. Father, touch the hearts of every member of this family. Transform them to have love for one another. From now on, I add to the family peace and progress from now on. That this will be a sign that you have done it. As they live together as one, there shall be continuous progress in the family. Your children in your time shall progress. And you shall enjoy them. Amen. And they will enjoy you. Amen. And every community where you are, they shall fear your family. Amen. They shall know the family as a great family. Amen. In Jesus Christ's name. Amen. Amen. Those uh, sit, uh, seated there. Before our president, I come against every spirit of pain and sickness. I command and come against every spirit of poison and affliction. And I command you right now, you of sickness and pain. Quit their bodies and go into abyss. In the name of Jesus, I command you to quit and I direct you to go into abyss. Never you wait to enter into them again. I send you to abyss. I chain you in abyss in the name of Jesus Christ. Let every pain in anybody's yet die away in the name of Jesus. And good health be restored unto you in the name of Jesus. Move out of that person and never to come back again. I send you into abyss. Let every dead part of you receive life. Let every weak part of you receive strength. In the name of Jesus Christ. Your fever, stop on fever. I said you quit their body in the name of Jesus Christ. Let life, let health encompass everyone that is here in the name of Jesus Christ. Wherever in your body where you have one form of pain or the other, whether it is by pausing or any other way, I command you with that poison, that sickness, that pain, to be healed in the name of Jesus. I release the healing power of the Holy Spirit to move among the people. Father, let your Holy Spirit touch each and every that is sick 
wherever he or she is. Your touch is enough to heal them. Your touch is enough to heal them. Holy Spirit divine, touch them and let them receive healing. Raging from minor headache, auto acute ones, from the head to the toe of your foot, wherever you have pains and sickness, in the name of Jesus Christ, let there be healing. I cost that power to die. I lay, I place a curse on that power to die in the name of Jesus. And let the children of God receive freedom from pains and sickness. Receive healing from pains and sickness. Wherever you are, if it is by injury, accident, for the time past, and you have tried, no way, tonight, let the bones of your body locate their proper places. Let every muscle of that part of your body locate their proper position. The ligament come into proper place. Every part of your body where you have sprain, dislocation, be healed in the name of Jesus. I pass the healing hands all over your body by faith wherever you are. As I pass my hands all over through your body, let every sickness in you be out in the name of Jesus. You sickness, I pick you out of the body. You pains, I remove you from the body. Wherever you are, you and your resistance, I remove them from the body. You poison caused by the devil, caused by the witches and wizards. I cause the poison to die in the name of Jesus Christ. Let everyone that is here receive healing now. I say receive healing now. The Lord is moving in a mysterious way. He's touching you. Receive your healing. Receive your miracle. Receive your miracle. In the name of Jesus. Every marriage that is at the verge of breaking tonight be amended in the name of Jesus. demarcation from tonight between your marriage and that spirit evil from tonight I cast them out of your marriage I restore love between you and your wife I restore love between you and your husband in the mighty name of Jesus is up to a marriageable age that has not gotten his husband. Father, it is true. It is man that looks for his wife. Father, the world has turned upside down and the girls have been pushed into the world to go and hook any husband and bring the husband. But tonight, oh God, let 
your creation stand firm. For the foundation of the world that you founded remains firm and constant. Every power that will change that situation, I cast that power out of our life. Married yet that by the miraculous work of God, your husband shall locate you. I send the angels of God before you to bring your husband to you. I know that God created the husband for you. You shall not be the one that will hook another person's husband. Because you are children of God. You shall be the head and not the tail. Your husbands are ready for you. Father, bring them to your children. Rest. In the name of Jesus Christ, I send the word of God out because of you. That until your husband locates you, he shall not be at rest. And the power of the Lord shall attract him to you in Jesus' name. As here on the crusade ground, where the blessings of God flows, every womb that has not carried a baby, if it's your daughter, wherever that your daughter is, because you are standing upon this crusade ground, I say I open the womb of that person. That is here by the power of the Holy Ghost. Your womb shall carry a baby. Every power that has locked you up, whether power of sickness, fibroid, oh, fibroid, I said God did not create you for this woman. I say, melt away from the tummy yeah. in the name of Jesus. Yeah. I cut every fiber yeah. to dry up yeah. and melt away from you in the name of Jesus. Yeah. Every sickness, every key and lock, oh. spiritual key and lock, oh. with which you were locked not to bear children. Oh. Womb. And by the breath of Jesus, I break that stone, that spiritual stone. I break them from your womb in the name of Jesus. Every gadget of evil prepared against you in any common world, in any occult world, in any spirit world. In the name of Jesus, that breath that broke the gates of hell and grace could not withstand it, I release it upon your life to break every gate locked against you. I break them open in the name of Jesus. Father, 
I set your children free. I said, you lady, go and bear your children from now on. You man, go and bear your children from now on. In the name of Jesus Christ. Our God is not wicked as not to give you a child. Because he has created you and has blessed you to be fruitful and to multiply and replenish the earth. I stand upon that word to declare upon every man and upon every woman that is seeking the blessings of the fruit of the womb to go and begin to bear their children. From this crusade now, at this time, uh, in our next, the first crusade of next year, according to the time of life, many of you shall come with your babies. In the name of Jesus Christ. Father, preaching of the gospel involves much finances. Your people cannot be borrowed. They will not go be going to the dormant of lenders anymore. We shall be the one to give to them. You shall be the one to give to them in the mighty name of Jesus. I command every mammal that is holding your finances, stealing it away from you, destroy your blessings. Several times and run into abyss. I set every mammal, I set their hands loose from your finances in the name of Jesus Christ. Our Father, I commit him unto you. He's so sweet and loving. How beautiful are the faith, are the feet of they that preach the gospel. If their feet are beautiful, how beautiful will the one that embraces the gospel will be? Father, because our daddy your servant has embraced your children and did not cast us out, did not cast us out. He embraced your world. Father, bless him. Amen. Bless his family. Amen. And so I commit this diocese that he oversees unto your hands. Father, in his time, I pray thee, let your spirit fill every priest in the diocese. Let the work of the spirit grow in the diocese. Let this diocese be known by their spirituality in the name of Jesus Christ. Above all, Father, when Solomon asked of wisdom, you knew that he equally needed money. He needed other wealth and you blessed him. Father, bless our bishop 
and the entire members in his thousands bless their finances in the name of Jesus. We lift the thousands upon your hand. Take over the thousands in the name of Jesus. We commit the committee that have been working with us unto your hands, Father. A laborer is worthy of his wages. Father, I pray that, Father, you bless them. Bless them. Keep them and their family. Remove them from lack in the name of Jesus. May they know you the more in Jesus Christ's name. And now to the crusaders. Father, we have preached your word. Let every weak one be strengthened now. In the name of Jesus. Let all the crusaders receive their blessings. In the name of Jesus Christ. And now I am going to leave a sign with you. And you shall give the testimony of this sign. I am talking again. You know many of you have given testimony. The sign I'm going to leave for you because you have preached the gospel in Afuze. Ask of one very important thing to you. Ask of one very important thing to you. At day before yesterday, before we came to the crusade, we have we were still receiving alerts of people that God has answered their prayers and are paying money in appreciation into the account of the ABS. In the name of Jesus. That which you have asked of the Lord, from whom all blessings flow, receive it in the name of Jesus. I said the Lord gives it to you right now in the name of Jesus. I said my God shall give it to you right now in the name of of Jesus. You shall not leave these grounds without this prayer being answered. By the time you get home, you will receive the manifestation of the prayer that has been answered here. And you will come with testimony. Receive the grace of this testimony in the name of Jesus Christ. And so, Father, I commit our movements back to our various destinations onto your hands. We want to worship you. We want to praise you. We want to honor you. We want to adore your name. We hallow you, Father, for all you've been doing for us from the very from the very day we set out for this crusade you led everyone here safely there was no casualty and you have been with us and you are still with us and you shall continue to be with us in the name of Jesus and so, Father, by tomorrow morning, your children will set out on their way home. In Jesus Christ's name, I send your spirits into every road that leads to everyone's house. And set the pillar of cloud before and 
and behind everyone as we go and lead each and every one of us safely to our destination. Let the pillar, thy pillar of clouds, cover every member with your cloud, the cloud of your presence. Cover every vehicle with the cloud of your presence. And lead each and every one of us safely to enter his or her house and meet his family or her family safe in the name of Jesus. There shall not be any mishap on the way. Every mishap that would have happened, I cancel it by the blood of Jesus. I sprinkle the blood of Jesus upon everyone. I mark every vehicle with the blood of Jesus. Every evil on the way shall see the blood and shall clear the way for you. Even the wicked one shall clear the way for you. In the name of Jesus Christ. As you came. If you have one form of ailment or the other, before you will not go without sickness. There are many of you, as you step, you cross your dormant into your house. Any resistant sickness will fly off you, will vanish off you will become yourself in the name of Jesus. Deliver us from every perils and dangers of this time we betray you through Jesus Christ our Lord. Let's say the grace together in fellowship. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with us all forevermore. Amen. Surely, surely goodness and mercy shall follow us all the days of our lives. And we shall bless the name of the Lord forever and ever. Amen. At least walk to three people and say, I am blessed. I just want to take a mind and a matter to do